Hi Lyra, sorry about the rain. We are talking about the preview for Sites 3, which is on page 9 of book 4. And we're going to, so just to explain the top half of the page, what's written on the left is what you see in the actual music. So from here, bar page 15, MM stands for measure, 125 to 126, so bar 125 to 126. Um, and so what you C is this. That's quite difficult to unpick. So the little arrow shows you that how you unpick it is the next bit. So the important thing is to add one, then add two, then add three, and then freeze and wait for the instructions. So we're going to have low on D sharp, a tone away, move your two and put your two on A, C natural, another tone. So you're in yellow with a hot pink three so far. Three on E, top A. Now, you check that all your fingers are down and then pick up one, put it behind the two, a semitone away, almost touching, and then pick up two and then play the B. Okay, so we're gonna play D sharp. You can do it with me this time. So D sharp on low one, ready, play. D sharp. Put your two a tone away, ready, play. Three a tone away, ready, play. Now stop, pick up your one, put it behind the two, pick up your two, and now play the one. Good, so you're going to do that five times. And then you're going to do it with the A string as well as the D sharp. So make sure you have a tunnel. Add the two. Go over to E and A, but keep the one on the D string. Then you do all the things we did before. Pick up the one, put it behind the two, pick up the two, and play these two notes together. And you do that ten times. So we'll do that together. Here we go. One and A. Ready? Play. Put your two on a tone away. Ready? Play. Tip over to E and A. Add top three. Ready? Play. Stop. Go through this ball very slowly. Pick up the one, put it behind the two, pick up the two, and now you play one and three. And those are tricky to tune, so if you have to adjust your fingers, do not worry, that's absolutely fine. Okay, so that's the first line sorted out. You do five times, just single notes, and then ten times with the double stops. And then this part is much easier, as is the third line, so that's good news. So the first exercise we do is this, B natural, D, keep that three on. F natural, low one, slide the one up a semitone, make sure that you've still got the three on. So let's do that together. B natural, ready, play, add the D, keep the three on, pick up the one, low one on E, slide the one up, don't lift the three. Good, so you're going to do that five times. And then we play double stops, the bow is on E and A the whole way through. Add your three, pick up the one, add the low one, slide up to F sharp for high one. And you're going to do that with me. Ready, go. Add the three, lift the one, low one on E, and slide it up to F sharp. And you're going to do that ten times. Okay, we're nearly there. And the last box is this part. And this is the easiest of them all. So they get hard, medium, easy. Um, and we're just going to practice A and E with the bow all the way through. And you've got the one on all the way through. You can see the line underneath the line. Music. So, tune it. Now, rock so that your one is on both strings. Low two. Three. Four. Perfect octave. And notice I've got all my fingers down, so don't change them as you go up. Just put them down and leave them there, and then pick up four. Pick up two, three. Pick up two. Rock so that you're on both strings with the one. And then rock your elbow forward so that you release the E, but you haven't lifted your one. So let's try that together. So find these notes. Ready, and. Rock your elbow back so you block the fingers. Add two. You don't need to worry about whether one is on the A and the E now. It can just be on A. Four. Three. Two. 
elbow goes back to make sure you cover both strings with the one elbow comes forwards to release the e but not the a one okay and you can do that 10 times good